No! You need to load all the way down there. I got it, I got it. Hello everyone, my name is Sandra and thank you so much for tuning in. All right y'all, so my Macy's Beauty Box finally came in. Y'all, when I ordered this back in December, okay, I ordered it right at the end of December thinking I was going to get a January box. Yeah, no, they never sent me one. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I ordered way too late and they had already like decided how many packages they were gonna make. And so I kind of lucked out on getting the January box, but I did get the February box. I am super excited. See y'all, the Macy's mystery box, not mystery. The Macy's beauty box is $15, which is very affordable. And you get a bunch of like deluxe minis. I don't think they put any full size items in there besides maybe like the special extra gift that they give. You you know, like how Ipsy with the glam bag, when you get the bag with all the stuff, you get a bag, that extra bag. Macy's does something like that, but it's not a bag. Sometimes it's a bag. But it's sometimes like other stuff. And so we're gonna go ahead and get into this and see what we got, see what we got in this box. Now, the first thing that I'm pulling out are things that I will not use. So I will be giving these away. They're just little uh, clips, little heart shaped clips. I mean, they're adorable, but I, I have no use for these. It says one for you and one for your bestie. Okay, so I'm gonna give them both to my besties. It rips in half, so I'm gonna open it up and rip it in half. That way I can get two gifts in one. You know what I'm saying? They're cute. They're definitely different. I've never seen any clips like this. That is nice for someone else. The next thing in here, ooh, by Elemis. And it is the Pro Collagen Rose Cleansing Balm, which is super nice because guess what? My elf is about to be out. I am like, I got like this much. I maybe got like two more face washes with that product. And so once that runs out, I'm busting out my Elemis, okay? I wonder if it smells like the old lady cream. Ooh, it's got like a nice little balmy texture, very nice. It doesn't really smell like anything. <laughs> I will be trying this out and taking off my makeup with it, seeing if it's just as good or better than the e.l.f. Next couple of things are wrapped up in some pink paper. This first item is the Magic Extensions Fiber Mascara. And this is by, oh, it's by MAC. So it comes in this little thingy right here and then you open it up and you got your little sample. That is nice. And I guess it has like little fibers in it to lengthen your eyelashes, like give you the illusion of wearing fake lashes. So this is a decent size, like a nice little travel. And there's the brush, just a regular brush. Next time I do my makeup, I am definitely gonna pull this bad boy out. The next item in here is by NYX. I love their setting spray. Their matte setting spray is that girl. This is the NYX, oh, and their butter gloss. I almost forgot. Their butter gloss is that girl too. This is the Smooth Whip Matte Lip Cream. Ooh. And this is what it looks like. Super teeny tiny and adorable. It's got like a nice little safety seal. That way I know nobody been in my lip product. It's kind of chunky. You see that? It's a little chunky, chunky, chunky monkey. Maybe that's the whip part. Ooh. Now, I don't really have too many reds, so I'm very excited for this. That is actually very, very pretty. Nice, deep red. Perfect for Valentine's Day, which tomorrow is going to be Valentine's Day because I'm filming this the day before Valentine's Day. I might bust this out for Justin. Okay, one time for the one. No! Just drop something. Ooh, and it done rolled all the way down there. I got it, I got it. This little lip product is really nice. I gotta wait to see if it dries down anymore because right now it doesn't look really matte. It still has like a satin finish. The next item in here is the teeniest of tiniest of little squeezy tubes. And this is by Estee Lauder and it is the Futuristic Peptide Powder Serum Primer. So we got an itty bitty teeny weeny primer. Super adorb. It's so itty bitty. Ittiest of bittiest. Let's see. It's the primer. It's really like thin. It's probably the thinnest primer I've ever tried. It made my hand feel really like smooth and nice. It's nice. It doesn't have much of a scent to it, so that's good. This still hasn't dried down. And the next thing is by Smashbox, and it is the Always On Liquid Lipstick Rouge. Ooh, okay. It, well, it kind of has separated a little bit, so that makes me think this might be old. <laughs> they might be giving us some like old-ish. 
and it is in the color stepping out. I don't know, maybe that separation doesn't mean what I think it means. Do you see that? Like the wand has like a little loop. The doe foot has like a little loop in it. I think that is so funny. That is a very interesting color. This is what that looks like. Very mauve -y, like a darker mauve. I think that is so pretty with like a nice brown lip liner. Be cute. And the last item in here is by John Paul. Galter? Galter? I think that's how you say it. And it is the Galter Divine. No, not Define, Divine. Galter Divine. And this is our fragrance sample. Hopefully she don't stink. Ooh, that's what the bottle was supposed to look like. I wish they would just like make little itty bitty miniatures of the bottle and then put them in there instead of these like basic ass tubes. So she comes like this. Put this like this so you can see. Let's see if we're gonna be smelling really bad for the rest of the day. It is definitely strong. It smells like the fragrance section of Macy's. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't smell bad. It doesn't smell that good either. It's like, I don't, I don't know. Does it say what the hints are? The tones or whatever they call it? The notes, that's what they call it, the notes of you don't say nothing about the notes. It smells sweet. It almost smells like that fragrance from Wake Heart, but just not as delicious, if that makes sense. It still smells really sweet though. You know, of course I gotta go check with my man and see if he likes the fragrance. Cause if he don't like it, I ain't gonna wear it. So, I mean, it's, it's, it's all good. It's not anything crazy, but it's not anything bad either. So I would wear this fragrance. Like when my other fragrances were out, then I'll like go to this one. That is everything that was in my Macy's beauty box. For a first box, I actually think it was pretty nice. I'm very excited for this Elemis, and then also the lip products and the mascara. And I mean, even the fragrance. The only thing I'm not like super excited about are, are these, cause I don't use them, but they'll make a great gift. It's still a win. I, I, I consider this a win. If you like this content, you already know what to do. Like, share, comment, and definitely subscribe so that you can become a Febe. And I will see y'all with the next one. Deuces. Thank <laughs> you.